2021, bitch. So we can do it like we do it like we do it like we do it. Welcome to this YouTube video featuring Remy Boy. Let me officially introduce you guys to Remy Boy. Today's video is things you should leave in 2020. Things you should stop. So let's get straight into the video. If this is your first time, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, all of that. My name is Visayo. I'm the Visayo you're looking through. Says eyes. Sorry, sorry. Let's get straight into the video. Agree to disagree. This is my opinion. If you don't agree with it, drop a comment and let's argue. Let me tell you why you should stop it. I wrote them down in my book. My book. <laughs> my book. Yeah, I said I have a book. I write stuff down. You should do that too. That should be one of the trends you should take to 2021. So, first and foremost, we are tired of seeing this. We see it every time. If I open my Instagram, I see it. TikTok, I see it there. Twitter is trending. Stop it. Slow mo. Stop. Like, okay, we get it. You you can like you can reduce your speed. You know like you like bro. Some of you are not even slow. Like we are tired of seeing slow mo. Just let that end. Let that stop in 2020. End it. Just stop. Do you agree? Remember? Boy? Number two. Number two thing you should not bring into 2020 is forex and trade there are we do not we are not doing like stop advertising i've said no once i will say no again and again i don't want to do i am not interested i understand you're making money you are making six figures you are rich i am not interested in forex i don't want to do read my lips i am not interested i don't want to do but wait, let's talk about my skin though 2021 skin <laughs> you're not even ready yeah, so number two thing is forex. Number three, period. Stop saying period. You have a Nigerian accent. Let's get that right. Like, you have a Nigerian accent. So when city girls are saying, hey, when they are doing all that period stuff, your accent does not go with period. So why the fuck are you saying period? It doesn't sound nice. Like, every single sentence, period. Stop. It's not cute. Number, I've lost count. Photoshop. Some girls would um like okay you want to you want to take a cute picture yeah and your your curvy like you have like a tiny waist itty bitty waist and um how am I going to put this you want it to like you want the waist to I don't know like you want your waist to be smaller then you take Photoshop you push your waist in but that wall that curtain behind is bending too. We can see it. Photoshop your pictures with sense. You can change the colors. We don't mind. But when you start bending the walls, that, that, that is not cute. That is not nice. Are you not embarrassed? Bitch, are you, are you not embarrassed? I'm literally throwing shade. I'm throwing shade at you. Yeah, I'm telling you. Stop bending the walls in your pictures. The next thing you should leave for 2020. This one is for my boys. Skinny jeans. What the fuck is this? Why would you be looking like you have broad, like big arms, <laughs> cute chest? Like, you're looking sweet at the top. Then you wear these. You wear skinny jeans. You wear skinny jeans. Like, why you wear? Remy boy will never do that. Jeans that you are struggling to pull out on your leg as a guy. Like, I understand females wearing skinny jeans because like we females have sexy legs and like that ass. So you want all of that to come out, but you are a guy. Just don't wear skinny jeans. That like, if you step to me. You try to talk to me wearing skinny jeans, you are cancelled. Rating that from 1 to 10, that is it, minus 1. It's, it's not fashion. You're looking like a triangle upside down. That, that's not cute. The next one you should stop is catfishing. This is the 21st century. You know that you're going to ask to FaceTime here. Yeah? You know you're going to ask for voice notes. Why are you using my pictures to catfish? And you that you're getting catfish. The victims of the catfishers, I don't know what they call them. You deserve it. Why are you getting catfished at this age and time? The next thing is this feminist. I'm I'm not I don't have anything against feminists. But you see this feminist independent woman talk of you don't need a man, you can be happy by yourself, giving girls tips on how to be single independent woman i don't need your money some people don't even say men again because you're forming feminist that thing is not cute you know like, it's not cute personally i feel like the thing irritates boys like men generally so stop all that independent woman talk it's not cute this one is for my fellow influencers sis baby 
my love you are using 50 skincare brands in the space of one month <laughs> baby <laughs> honey we see, we see it like babe why are you using two skincare brands at the same time i'm an influencer i know i know i know i know that the money is sweet and like, we see it but baby we can see it though Redu reduce the leg stop like they're they making fun of us are you not embarrassed the next one is for instagram couple youtube and um, couple channels on youtube okay you're pranking somebody here yeah? and the camera is literally in front of you you place the camera in front of the person you're pranking and you're telling me that as blind as i am this is a gopro a gopro is tiny this is like the tiniest camera youtubers used to film okay let's say you're using a gopro to prank somebody you put the gopro right in front of the person and you're telling me the the person you're pranking is not seeing the gopro or the camera right in front of them I, i'm a fan of youtube couples instagram couples but your pranks are looking too fake these days it is not cute Wait, i'm throwing shit right now stop stop with the fake pranks do it from your chest we know we know baby and you guys you are rubbing it in too much like i know i know that some of us are single even though like i have a boy you you guys will be kissing on your story you'll be doing couple goals yeah that's that about that instagram couples youtube couples we are kind of tired we are tired like stop it your dating doesn't mean you should post it i would post mine if i have mine but i don't have so stop the next one still for my ladies waist trainers let me let me let me let you see this i'm not saying you should not wear waist trainers you wear this waist trainers yeah you wear a tight dress we can see this baby this thing is showing we can see right through like why would you go out like looking like this baby you're supposed to wear strain indoors and remove it they sell invisible waist trainers you know invisible waist trainers that you can wear under but i still don't know how you people do that thing because i wore this thing for like just two minutes now and i cannot even breathe well some females some women some ladies y'all will wear this thing under your clothes the whole day it is showing like baby we can see this someone to hug you we will not be feeling like your waist is hard why is your waist hard sis it just stop the lines are showing you can see it, baby this next one is to the general public it's to everybody this drew my attention from insta blog every single person insta blog posts popular actress popular influencer which film did you act and you are an actress how are you an actress if you've not acted any film hmm? How are you an influencer if you've not influenced for any brand? It's like everybody buys something is then like, oh, thank you for sending me this product. Baby, <laughs> we know you bought it though. Like we know that you bought it. You have 200 followers, two posts, and your bio is actress, influencer, baby. Stop it. Leave that in 2020. Don't bring it into 2021. Another thing we should um we should not do, that like we should stop doing is this one is for my babies, my teenagers like i have a lot of young people that want my channel you meet them and they're like oh what's your age like how old are you they ask you how old are you oh i'm 15 but my mind is 25 <laughs> baby wait we'll wait for it baby like it's going to come to you like stop saying that leave that in 2020 that's all i'm going to say about that just stop just leave it so one more thing okay no actually two more things this one is personal to me this one is something that i've always wanted to say like okay you you send me a dm on instagram and like i reply you when i text back if we continue the conversation for like three lines the next day you're like hey bestie the next second you add me to your close friends the next thing you're calling my number anytime you're calling me by 12 a.m in, in the night baby that thing that that attitude of I don't know what I call it. Should I call it fanzine? It is irritating. It is disgusting. Stop it. Leave it. Leave it in 2020. Stop. This one is the last but not the least. Everybody knows about this. Every single person in this world knows about it. This one, I think I need to stand to say this. Corona. Corona. COVID. COVID was a trend. COVID trended. COVID almost ruined. COVID ruined lives. COVID is still ruining lives. COVID was a trend. COVID trended enough. COVID-19, Corona. <coughs> Pack and go. We, 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 we really don't want you. Like, you've done your best. You ruined birthdays. You added one year to my... Okay, maybe more than one year. You added one year to my university stay. You've tried. Like, okay, we've, we recognize you now. We know you. We respect you, baby. COVID. Go. Like, I am 
be fast. Like, you still want the attention? Just go. Ready. Oh, Kobe, please, wherever you are, or oh, the number of people you've affected in Nigeria, all over the world, stop. Like, by 11.59 this night, just pack your load and go. Okay? Yeah. So that's all I have to say about the trends we should leave in 2020 most of you some of you might not agree with like all the things i've stated but i agree to disagree i said already that's my opinion if you agree with me fine kudos good for you if you don't i mean fine kudos good for you yeah and that should be the end of the video don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, share with your friends, share to your group chat that you always talk about me, share to my haters, share to your haters, share to your friends, send it to your mommy, send it to your daddy, send it to your sister, watch it on your television. Remember to not skip my ads so I'll be able to eat this new year. Merry Christmas. I know I didn't do like a vlogmas this year because I was lazy. So, um, yeah. Happy New Year to everybody. Pray for God's blessing. Like, make sure you guys pray because this year has been a very rough year. It has been a rough, rugged year for everybody. So, make sure you pray. Thank God for keeping you throughout 2020. And, yeah. Basically. So, yeah, guys. Thank you for watching. We have come to the end of the video. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. All of that. I said already. Yeah, watch my other videos too because this is your first time. Just watch my other videos. Peace out, guys. I see you in 2021. My next video is going to be 2021. So, bye, bye. bye.